Hey everybody, welcome to USA Hockey Arena in Plymouth, Michigan, the home of the National Team Development Program. I'm Pete Krupski alongside U17 goaltender Harrison Bettiger. And uh, Harrison, first of all, I know you're busy. Thanks for your time. I need to know something. Mm -hmm. How do you pronounce your last name? It's actually Bettiger. Bettiger. Bettiger, yeah. See, I'm glad I asked yeah, you. Now, you now your parents won't get mad at me. <laughs> you make a great save and I come up with mm -hmm. something else. So yeah, it's no. Bettiger. Bettiger, yeah. Okay. Right. You grew up in Colorado, but right. you ended up playing for a time for the St. Louis Junior Blues. How did that happen? Uh, I have some family in St. Louis. Okay. My uncle, his name is John Mosaic, and he's the president of the St. Louis Cardinals. Ah. So uh, I spent some time with him out there, and uh, they just I didn't have a spot in Colorado. So we decided to uh, go to somewhere we know. So yeah, well, yeah. so family helped out with yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, family did help out for sure. So uh, you get a few uh, box seats to the Cardinals games. Yeah, maybe? every time we head down there, we get tickets. We get to go on the field and stuff. So it's perfect. It's a cool experience. How did you end up at Shattuck St. Mary's? Uh, you also played there for a couple of years. I did. Yeah, um, I think I was gonna go play on their uh, 06 team the year before, but I was my dad didn't want me to go because I was too young. So we always had that in our back pocket. Yeah. And we just decided it was the best place for me. So Shattuck is one of the elite uh, programs in the mm -hmm. country. Yeah. Uh, and now you're here at the National mm -hmm. Team Development Program. Some of the, the same question I've asked the other Shattuck guys. You go from one elite program mm -hmm. to another. Are there similarities? There's, there's definitely a whole bunch of similarities. They all preach the same um, values and stuff, like uh, work first. You t you, like, you're responsible for how far you go in the game. You can have all the resources in the world, but it's it's down to like you as a person and as a player and uh, both programs definitely um, support the idea that being a person is just as important as being a good hockey player you can go as far in the game as being a good person as you can as a player so sounds like there's a little bit of pressure to all that do yeah you, do you mind that uh, no I, I love it actually I feel like I play better under pressure so do you yeah, definitely <laughs> let me ask you this we'll mm -hmm. talk about hockey for a second all right um, you give up a goal, mm -hmm. and it doesn't matter if it's a, a great play on their part mm -hmm. or you know, maybe you make a mistake. Mm -hmm. How do you rebound from goals? Because sometimes, you know, you're going to get lit up uh -huh. every once in a while. Yeah. How, how, do you, how do you get past that? Um, just kind of think about stuff away from the game that will make me smile. Okay. Just like uh, after the game, I can call my mom or my dad, yeah. text them, just talk to them about stuff that's not hockey. Um, and there's always a new shot, a new opportunity. So you, you start letting goals in, but you've always got the next one. So how is your uh, goaltending coach, uh, uh, Coach Lassonde, helping? Mm -hmm. uh, he's just always giving me a way out, because every goal you can stop. It doesn't matter if it's a back door or a, a muffin that you buy. Do you believe in. that? Every I do goal you can that. stop? Yeah, I mean, there's a way to stop every puck. It's not going to be easy, but uh, if you just, it's all technical too. You got to have a plan before you, uh, before you act upon what you're going to do, so. But there's all kinds of traffic yeah, out there I mean, on the blue ice. And, I mean, there's there's chaos. Yeah, there is. How do you how do you work through all that chaos to uh, make the stop? You just gotta find a window. You just gotta find a way. Okay. Yeah. So sometimes it's not technical. It's no. just wanting to it's do just it. It's battling. Right? Yeah. It's a battle. Mm -hmm. What's it like practicing against all these elite players that are your teammates now? Uh, it's crazy because one moment you know they're putting a post in it and you just you just ask yourself how do I save that? But you know it's it definitely makes you a lot better because every day you're going up against the best. So it's like uh, coach had this saying, that's like iron sharpens iron, so. Okay. Yeah. Who's the hardest guy for you to stop on uh, this team? Definitely Bell. Why? He's got a heavy shot and it, and it hurts. So, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Do you like uh, going up in shootouts uh, during competition? I'm not talking about mm -hmm. the, w with your team, but we get into uh, yeah. a game and it's a shootout yeah. to, to win the game. Yeah, it's, Does that bother you? No, I love that. It's probably the most fun part of hockey. Why? Just you and the shooter. Yeah? It's all. It's just who's, who's going to win the battle. So So if you win the battle <laughs> in the shootout, do you have a sally after the game? I after mean, after winning? I don't, but I should. I, that would be pretty. Okay. Pretty. Yeah. Harrison, what's the hardest thing for you since joining the NTDP? We've been at it a couple months right now. Is it off ice, on ice, whatever? Um. Off ice at the beginning was pretty tough. Uh, they put us to a test, to a challenge, yeah. with all the workouts and stuff. But um, it's still hard knowing you have to work your best every day. But it's the only way you can get what you want out of it. So. OK. What, what's it like being with all your, your, your buddies, your brothers? I mean, it's a brotherhood, right? Yeah, it is a brotherhood. Um, it's, it's a lot like Shattuck St. Mary's, too, because okay. you live with everybody. And it's more of a family. Yep. So I mean, 
it's a lot tighter than other junior teams would be, and I love that. I love the boys. So, Harrison Bettiger, is that <laughs> Bettiger, right? Yeah, Bettiger, I got, got it right. Mm -hmm. What's uh, what's it like putting on that jersey? I mean, pretty soon you're going to be playing mm -hmm. an international competition. Uh, you played in Blaine, which yeah. had a packed house. <laughs> what's it like putting on that jersey? Uh, just wearing your country, it's it's an unreal feeling, and okay. it's uh, a feeling I wish everybody could feel because it's it's one of the most amazing things in the world. So, Harrison, we'll let you yeah. go. You did a great job. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank you, Harrison yeah. Bettiger, Everybody, there you go. <laughs>